Good morning, everybody. Earlier this week, I went into the grocery store. I'm just picking up a few items. I went into the produce section, and the corn, <clears throat> the whole air of corn, historically, we always paid, you know, 10 for a dollar, maybe 20 cents a piece, and, you know, during drought season. But this week, I looked, and they had 80 cents for one air of corn. I was like, get out of here. So I said to myself, well, I guess I'll go ahead and plant me some corn, harvest me some corn where I don't have to worry about buying corn as we get into the summer. So today, I'm going to be working on a part of the, of the field where I'm going to, I've started tilling it up. I'm going to put some manure in it and get it all prepared so I can start planting corn. So come along, go with me for this ride. Uh, as I was showing you before, I have this mound of cow manure right here that's been composting for a good couple, a few months and I'm going to load up my dump trailer, take it over to this other spot that I'm going to be working on and build it up and then I'll start planting some corn. So let's get started with this fun time. Okay, I've got here a full load of this manure and oh man, that sure smells, <laughs> that's some stink stuff, but as they say out in the farmland, that's the smell of money, so that thing is ripe, oh my goodness, that will make, that there will make some good fertilizer, that is so ripe, well, let's haul it over to the garden. And let's get started. Well, I'm coming through here to dump this load. It's been raining and it's gonna be a little wet. So I hope we don't get stuck. But I've got it in four wheel drive. And hopefully we can muscle through this. This is a spot I'm preparing for a cornfield. It's still pretty wet I plowed it up a little bit and now it's pretty wet so I'm gonna have to stop right there and try to dump this load it's pretty heavy and I'm uh, had a hard time getting in here so I'll probably just do this one load and come in here with the truck and spread it out let's go to work We have our first load down. I'm gonna go ahead and probably get two or three more loads. I'll set it right in here. Then I'll come with the tractor and I'll have to spread it out and till it in all around here. Fun continues, folks. Let's get her done. Well, this is my second load. Look as if I'm gonna have to drop it right here. I'm a bit stuck in the mud I'm slipping and sliding and can't go nowhere all four of my wheels I've got a four-wheel drive and I'm not going anywhere this load is too heavy so I'm just gonna have to drop it here and that might be it for the day but I'll drop it there and uh, move it with the tractor but I think I'll have to stop with all this wet ground once I got that load off the trailer, I was able to get out of that groove. Well, I'm out of that groove, but I didn't drop the load where I would like it, but it's here. I think I'll try to get one more load in here 
I'll try to see if I can finesse my way through this tight spot with that trailer. Well, folks, we're back with a third load. We got a tight spot. Let's see if we can get through there. That's where we're going to be trying to go. We got stuck in here with that second load. So it's going to be real tight playing this fence. So I'm going to see if we can get through there. If not, we'll just have to drop it wherever we can. There you have it folks, there's my third pile. Uno, dos, tres. I've got three piles of that cow manure. But right now it's too muddy back here. There's still a little bit of standing water. And for me to bring the tractor back here, it's gonna be a mud mess and it's gonna be ugly. So I'll give it another days maybe next weekend if it's dried up enough I'll come in and take care of that but we did it and we're ready to go well you have yourself a good day and until next time be safe out there bye bye <laughs>